Hi, welcome to another Power Blast podcast. I am not a fitness expert. I am not a nutritionist. I am not a certified trainer. Heck, I didn't even sleep at a Holiday Inn Express last night. But I am an independent team beach body coach, and I've successfully completed P90X and P90X Plus several times, and I want to talk about it. All right, just like I promised last week, I was blending up some almond butter. Oh, love that stuff. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think Perry uh, had a bit much all week long, but anyway, going to make use of some of that. Um, I absolutely love the uh, Team Beach Body message boards. You can find some some amazing tips and ideas and things that people are always sharing, uh, plus a lot of inspiration. One of the things um, off the the Shakeology site, and there's been a lot of things. People are always sharing their recipes on there of what they've what they've created. Shakeology pie. Oh, doesn't that sound good? Um, so what what we're gonna what we're gonna put together? I'm gonna try it because I haven't I haven't given it a shot yet. But that's one of the things. Uh, it printed it off so I wouldn't make any mistakes. But the ingredients is gonna take a, a container of tofu. So I got a 12 ounce package of uh, some uh, some tofu there, um, the the firm kind, and uh, one and a half scoops of chocolate. Shake allergy is going to be in there. A half a cup of peanut butter. PT is going to use some almond butter in there. Um, got to measure that out. I'm hoping some is left. And uh, a couple of tablespoons of uh, almond breeze. Um, it has soy milk in here. I use the almond milk. And then there's um, a graham, graham cracker crust. I uh, found a um, found this in the natural foods aisle at my grocery store. It's by Arrowhead Mills. All right, got this tofu stuff. Now you already do. If you're new to tofu, you need to need to drain that stuff. I'm gonna just kind of cut this up into a couple little slices here to put in there. This is the firm stuff. Get that blended up a little bit. Now I'm gonna add some of that Shakeology in there. One and a half scoops. Two tablespoons of the almond breeze soy milk. Well, that's actually almond breeze almond milk, not soy milk. Oh, look what that is. Oh. All right, let's measure out a half cup of this. I know what some of you are saying. Why measure? Just dump it in there. I have plans for a little bit of the remains. Oh, it's almost going to be a half cup anyway. Dang. Oh. When accuracy works against you. All right. And we'll dump some of that in there. And that there. And let's just turn it on. Perry's going to say that that's ready to pour in there. So I'm going to set this back a little bit. Bring that out. Unlock. Let's take a look, folks. Tell me that doesn't look <laughs> awesome. Yeah, uh-huh. It's nice and thick already. Tell me you wouldn't want to serve this to people. You'd never let you ne never let your guests know that you're serving them a pie that's giving them five trips to the salad bars worth of nutrients, vitamins, minerals. They're getting their their supplement for the day. They're gonna feel full. You know what? You could probably just have pie for dinner. a bit left. So anyway, there it is. I'm going to go I'm going to go put it in the fridge. 
for about an hour. I'll probably let it set a little, little bit longer than that, but Shakeology pie. Can't wait to try it. Let's go do that, man. Put it in there. All right, a few hours has gone by, and I think I showed you this before. Mm -mm -mm. Now, this might be considered one serving for some people like myself, but I am going to do the thing and <laughs> slice it up into portion sizes. I know, I know. Um, and then to do the taster and see see how it holds up. I'm not sure how it firmed up or anything like that. I'm going to bring the camera over here and see what things look like. All right, let's do some slicing here. Crust does pretty well. So not bad. A good little consistency thing there. But Perry, we're wondering, how does it taste? Yeah, I know. So anyway, gonna gonna take a little little taster. See if this will be something I'll serve up. Any guesses? Hmm? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A lot more uh, thick consistency than I expected. I think my next house party, my next uh, fitness home party, instead of blending up Shakeology in the blender, I may just have one of these. Because it's nice and thick. The, um, the peanut butter part to it, or the almond butter that I, that, that I use, um, has, um, gives it almost that stick to the roof of your mouth uh, consistency. But, um, man, I know it's going to be filling because Shakeology um, fills the bill for uh, meal replacement types of things. Having a slice of pie, so it's like dessert, I, I don't know if I would eat a full meal and then have a slice of pie, but in the uh, middle of the day type of snack or uh, later in the, later in the um, for, for dessert, a few hours afterward, after Thanksgiving, Easter, this might be a good Easter treat to do. And uh, uh, while almond butter might not be the most ideal thing for those people who are doing St. Patty's Day, I bet you the tofu with the green berry, just with the green color, uh, might be a fun thing. Of course, this podcast will be done by the time St. Patty's Day is around. But anyway, that's it from PT's Kitchen. Pretty awesome, huh? Thank you. Anyway, remember, it's never too late. We'll see you next week. Mmm. <laughs>